right now I'm using the Asbot Tiny PTZ webcam. Um, I just wanted to do a video to show you guys, for one, what the video quality is. Right now I have it hooked up to my OBS and that is where I am making this video. So this is the webcam quality. Um, it was really easy to set up. All I had to do was plug it into the back of my computer. It's a USB style plug and play. Um, and like I said, I use OBS. So my OBS recognized it as a new video capture device right away. Um, this does have gesture control. So when you put your hands up next to your face, like I'm going to do in a second, it will recognize you as the target and then it keeps you center framed. So I'm going to do that and then I will show you how when I move in front of the camera, I don't have a ton of space to move around, but you'll see that the camera follows me. So I'm going to put my hand up for the gesture control. And now it's flashing blue and then green to let me know that it recognizes me as the target. So now that I'm the target, I can move and it will go with me. So that's the camera moving on its own. Slide back over. And it just slowly osculates. Um, pretty cool. You can also do a gesture for zooming in. So to do that, you kind of make an L by your face, just framing it, and it will zoom in. So I'm going to do that. <laughs> so that is the zoom. Woo! Left it up too long. That is the zoom function on that. Um, this can go on a tripod like I have it right now. And it also comes with this. It is a little clip that goes on top of your computer. And this is a magnet. And the bottom of the webcam has a magnet on it to just click onto this. So that's pretty cool too. Um, like I said, really easy to set up. All I had to do was plug it into my back, the back of my computer. And it was good to go. So that is the Ausbot Tiny PTZ. Hopefully that helps you if you're looking at it. Um, I would say the lighting that you're seeing right now is a little more dim than my phone camera when I use that, but it's also a webcam, so that's a huge difference too. Um, and I do have it in front of a ring light right now, but usually the back of this room is not lit up anyways. So yeah, that's the Ausbot Tiny PTZ webcam. This is a tiny PTZ webcam. Look at this. I absolutely love this. So you have AI, you have AI powered framing and you have gesture control with this too as well. It's a 1080 pixel webcam. It's dual omnidirectional too as well. You have a 90 degree wide angle view, a low light correction, and it works with zoom and a lot of other types of video applications too as well. Here's the OBS bot here. I love the design here. You have the USB-C in the back here. So you just simply plug this in to use it and then plug it into whatever device you're trying to use it with. And then you have a mount too as well, which I really like this. This you have where it's magnetic. So you can just simply snap this into place if you wanna put it on your computer. Or you do have a thread here at the end if you want to mount it onto a tripod, you can do that too as well. So let's go ahead and give it a go. I have the OSV bot here hooked up onto my computer. So I have this OBS software that I'm going to share with you and how you can use this. You can again, zoom in if you want. You can zoom out too. So it's going to follow me again wherever I go around the room. So we'll go this way and again, then zoom out. How cool is that? It'll be green when the target is locked and then it'll turn like yellow when target is lost. The picture is absolutely amazing with this webcam here. Look at the clarity of that. I think this is so great. This is the OBS Bot Tiny. This is a very, very cool uh, PTZ camera. On the back here, we've got some of the specifications, including the fact that it does This is the OBS Bot Tiny. This is a very, very cool uh, PTZ camera. On the back here, we've got some of the specifications, including the fact that it does AI tracking, gesture control, full HD, and it's got a two axis gimbal in it as well. Product box, very, very nicely presented. We also get a warranty card, and we also get a user manual as well. Inside the box, you get these three components. You get a cable, which is USB-A to USB-C. This is used to connect to and to power the camera. 
We also get a little tiny mount. So this has uh, got a little sticky bud on it and this sort of comes out like so. Magnet on this end allows you to connect the camera in various positions. And then we of course get the camera itself. And this is very cool, very, very cool indeed. Controlled by the app uh, to be able to rotate, to be able to track your face. So if you move around in the frame, it keeps you in the center, also keeps you very nicely in focus. It's got this gimbal as well, so you can get really uh, good sort of presentation going. If you're sitting in front of a normal web camera, it's a static image. With this, it adds a bit more flair to your presentation. This is great for if you're doing some sort of instructional webinar, for example, a video conference. The fact that it can rotate around and it's got the uh, sort of gimbal action going on as well. Very, very good indeed. The quality of the video is superb. The autofocus and the tracking, well, sometimes it does lose it a little bit, but for the most part, it is a very, very impressive piece of kit. I really do like how this looks and I like the results that it delivers. On the bottom here, we've got a threaded mount. We've also got a little rubberized piece on the bottom to keep it nice and steady on your desk. I think the OBS Bot uh, Tiny is a great camera, easy to control and great results.